want to tell a story and it's got morals with it, right? Because um, I love stories with morals because you can learn and become a better person. Here it is. I'll tell the story first. I was driving in my car the other day and I stopped at the traffic lights, right? And the lady that was in the car directly in front of me, I saw her open her car door, lean out, spit onto the road, close the car door and then drive off again. I was like, that's disgusting, that's gross, that's awful. I'm really judging her. And then I thought to myself, like, if I was in that situation and I was like trapped in a car with a mouth full of spit, what would I do, yeah? And I thought to myself, I would probably like either swallow it back down or maybe like spit into my <laughs> shirt. <laughs> And then I started thinking, like, that's pretty gross as well. And then I kept on thinking, like, which out of those three is the best option? Because they're all pretty gross. And I kept on thinking about it. And then before I knew it, two whole minutes had passed and I hadn't swallowed. And I had a mouthful of spit. And without even thinking, I just opened the car door, spat onto the road, closed it and drove off again. That's the story. Yeah. That's it. My morals, yeah. There's three morals that I want to take you to take with you. One... Don't judge other people, yeah? Don't judge other people because that lady was just me two minutes earlier, yeah? And there was probably a lady like two minutes before her that was in the same, and then a lady two minutes before her as well. And I'm just part of this like snowball clusterfuck of women that have like spit trapped in their mouth and they can't get out of their car. So don't judge people, yeah? Number two, trust your instincts. Yeah, trust your instincts, particularly when you're trapped in a car with a mouthful of spit. Just do what you think is natural and it will probably end up okay, yeah? And number three, uh, love yourself. Yeah, love yourself. That's not really related to the story, but you should. You, sh you should.